Hi, and welcome to how to auto-provision HTAC phone video tutorial. In this video, we will use HTAC UC924 to demonstrate the auto-provisioning. However, the same procedure can be used for other HTAC phones as it is very similar. Easiest way to auto-provision your phone is through the phone web interface. To access the phone web interface, you will need your phone IP address. Your phone IP address can be found inside the phone main menu. Simply open status and then network menu. And under IP field, you will see your phone IP address. Enter the address in your browser and use your login credentials. If you haven't changed default HTAC login credentials, enter admin for both username and password. Once logged in, the first thing you need to do is to reset your phone to factory settings. Unless your phone is brand new and is currently set to factory settings, then you don't have to do this step. Otherwise, under Management menu, select Upgrade submenu and click on the Reset to Factory Settings button. It will take a minute for your phone to reset and reboot. When done, log back into Phone Web Interface. Next, you will need to check your firmware. It is important that your phone is loaded with the appropriate firmware version. Different models may require different firmware versions. You can look up which version is supported for your device at wiki.bicomsystems.com slash UADs to check which version of the firmware you have currently installed. Inside the phone web interface, navigate to Home menu. Your firmware version will be displayed at the top. If you have trouble installing the firmware, please contact Bicom support team. Next, you will need to adjust UAD settings, create the extension and register your phone. Select the desired tenant and under Tenant Settings menu, Navigate to UAD. Find your device and open the device edit options. Make sure the general section status is set to active and that under auto provisioning section, auto provisioning and DHCP is set to yes. Once done, click save to apply the settings. Next, under extensions menu, click on add extension. Select your device from UAD list and under location, set remote. Click Next Step button, specify the extension name and email, select the department and under Mac, enter the Mac address of the phone. You can find the Mac address on the back of your phone and also inside the phone web interface under Home menu. Once you have entered the Mac address, click Save to apply the settings. This completes all the settings you need to do inside of PBXware. Next, you will need to register your HTAC phone by setting up the provisioning server. Go back to your phone web interface and under management menu, navigate to auto provisioning submenu, select TFTP for an upgrade mode and under config server path, enter your server IP address or a host name. Once done at the bottom, click on the save set button to save your settings. Once your settings have been saved, click on auto provisioning button to auto provision your phone. Once you have successfully finished auto-provisioning process, you will need to reboot your phone. Navigate to Reboot menu and click on the Reboot button. If you have done everything correctly, your phone will restart and once it's finished rebooting, you should have successfully registered your phone to PBXware. Thank you for watching this video and if you need more help, be sure to visit Bicom Systems Wikimedia page.